this morning. We are delighted to be catching up with the multi-talented Chrissy Metz. You know, we all love her as Kate Pearson oh, on NBC's yes. hit show, This Is Us. Well, now Chrissy is switching gears and hitting the road to perform some of her new country music on a seven-city tour, and she's here to tell us all about it. Good morning. Hey, y'all. Hey. Good morning. Hey. Yeah. It's so nice to see you all. Well, uh, well, it's been you know, a minute. I, I, yeah. I know. It's been a while. It's, it's been, so much has been happening. But I, I knew you, you you had all this musical talent, but I didn't know how much you love country music. Oh, yeah. I mean, music was like my first love, and I grew up in Florida, and I also was just influenced by all genres of music. My mm. parents love music, and I just feel like country music, the, the storytelling aspect is so special. And I yes. think I love to do that, as we can we can tell yeah. from the TV show I happen to be on. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, it just it just felt right. It's so interesting because a lot of people would think the acting was first and then the music. But it was, it's clear that music is a love of yours. Right? Oh, yeah, for sure. I mean, I was making tapes in my, my bedroom <laughs> in my boom box and, you know, trying to record and write poetry. But oh, I love it. so what was the inspiration behind this new this music? Really, like, love, loss, the past 10 years of my life. Like, gratitude, but also really healing through the feeling. And for a healing long time... Healing. Right? Let's <laughs> marinate. Yes. Okay. For a long time, I was afraid to feel, because, like, it's uncomfortable. Yep. You have to go through it, and the only way to go is through. Mm -hmm. So I found music always to be really cathartic. Mm -hmm. And, I mean, it's healed me in many ways, so writing and being able to perform the songs now is like a dream yeah. it's like unreal so exciting so let's let's talk about uh this is us yes. uh, my wife and i we just love the show so much you wrapped it up a few months ago yeah. i read somewhere that you are open to the idea perhaps of a reunion down the road uh, yeah like 10 years from now yeah. like, yeah. how it's, too, it it's too raw right now. yeah, yeah it's too raw it's too soon. what it's part too soon. of the story do you think would mm. be the impetus for the for the reunion is there a part that, that left you wanting a bit more? Ooh. You know, oh gosh. I mean, the stories of people's lives like continue yeah. for years and, and decades. So I don't know. I think it could be anything. Mm -hmm. But it would, I love to see kids grow up and like mm -hmm. what Tess and Annie would be doing yes. and Jack and Haley. Right. I mean, obviously we know Jack, spoiler alert, becomes a really big famous music uh, guy. But um, I don't know. I think that could go it could go anywhere. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, but yeah, I'm down for it. Okay. If Dan Fogelman's involved, Dan. Then, you're in. then you're in. All right, Dan. Yes, yeah. Put it out in the universe. So we'll, we'll check in in ten years. Right. Um, <laughs> let's talk about your children's book because you're yeah. also an author. You wrote this with your boyfriend. Yeah. When I talk to God, I talk about you. Yeah. Is the name of it. Tell us about it. Yeah. So over the pandemic, you know, people are you know really getting to know one another, and it was. I mean, the beginning of my relationship with my boyfriend, but, you know, you sort of talk about, like, do you want kids? Do you not? And mm -hmm. I taught preschool. I have a huge family and I love kids. And I just know that it's so important, the foundation of like encouraging them and empowering them yes. and supporting them. But also we had a lot of friends who want to become parents, mm -hmm. whether it's adoption or fostering or biologically. And so it was really just the impetus of like, we understand the desire to want to have that connective tissue with children and how important it is. Mm -hmm. Like as cheesy as it sounds, children really are the future yeah mm -hmm. so it really just blossomed okay. from that yeah yeah and, and you guys just celebrated your second anniversary we did oh, congratulations Yo, we got through covid We're together I know. Can I believe wild. It? that's wild really it's like we've been together for 10 years <laughs> <laughs> if you've gone through a pandemic yeah, together and he's also a songwriter so th is. there's a synergy there too yeah we've written once and then i was like you know what i really want him to have his thing mm -hmm. and i don't want to sort of taint it with like my ideas or you know and vice versa i think it's really important for people to have their own thing but he is he's a very deep guy like still waters run deep so it's um it's nice it's great yeah that. well we're so excited for you thank and you. Uh, good luck with the tour thank yes. you Everything. next time oh, come goodness. and perform here in the studio I know. okay all right okay, okay. Already I booked will. Love yeah. to. Yeah. thank you yes. <laughs> i'm booked i'm booked great chrissy thanks <laughs> thank so you. much hey uh, chrissy's tour kicks off tonight Philly. in philadelphia chanel's town yeah, yeah. Okay. So uh, you can go to her website for all tour dates and details. And remember, all seasons of This Is Us available on Hulu and NBC.com. Oh, my gosh. Have the best time tonight. Thank you. Probably just as fun for you as it is for all of us listening. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I, uh, yeah. I it's love beyond. It. I love beyond. it. All right. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Find your favorite recipes, celebrity interviews, uplifting stories, shop our favorite deals, and so much more with the Today app. Download it now.